I joined the PvP guild. Oh yeah? How's that going? They're badass. Oh, they do the open world thing? Yeah. Nice. God we sucks. stole two scrolls last night. You what? We stole two scrolls? I don't know what that means. As in Elder Scroll. Okay. No, uh, each faction has two scrolls, and those scrolls give you PvP bonuses. It's kind of like, wow, you know, you capture their fucking shit. Capture something and, that gives you bonuses. Yeah, and perks. you gotta hold on to it. Stop stole it. stuff in the Imperial City, or is that something else? No, that's uh, the map in the middle. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Kyrodrill. Kyrodrill. Kyrodil. Well, very cool, sir. Very cool. So now we have a group to join for PvP. Yeah, it's, uh, they're kind of a younger guild, but guild, the, the raid leader was pretty darn good. I was impressed. That makes a little difference. have a couple hundred people that have no fucking clue but if the guy running the show knows exactly what's going on that's enough yeah hell they just pugged me invited me boom so I'm sure you guys get in pretty easily no I'm yours of course please um fine damn it I'm yours to do of course well well part of Oh, with their mandatory team speak. Team speak? Oh, that's something. Yeah. Easy enough to install all that shit, whatever they want. How long did that take? One thing, though. Oh, I played for several hours. So that's pretty much sort of like the PvP we had in Warhammer Online way back in a day where you can pretty much like join up and there's just something going on 24-7. Yeah. Awesome. You go on your level cap character, or? Yeah. Okay, so you can't really tell whether there's like an XP gain or whatever. Oh yeah, if you're below uh, 50, you get experience. You followed through. I you earned my man. esteem, my oh, friend, and that that's no small thing. Fun. You're a friend to the Ring of Daggers now. Large skill. Heard you've been I'm trying to make amends, old man. Graphics? You know what I Should think. Oh, you gotta turn the graphics down. The only redemption for a murderous bastard like Come you back. is a slow, painful death. And we're going to give it to you. Get up. You can rot in the stockade for a little while first. Lock him up. Make sure to spit in his face every hour, too. With pleasure. I guess this is what I did. Yeah, no idea I made some changes. Okay, uh, you might find this interesting. So I looked at uh, who clicks, who people, or which advertising people click on. Uh -huh. 
So it looks like nobody was interested in Eve whatsoever. And nobody clicked on anything from Amazon. Every single Really? Yeah, every well nobody bought anything or nothing really happened there. Um, the only stuff that uh, like actually had action, which is like people actually clicked on a banner and then went to the website and then actually read stuff and looked at things, uh -huh. was the Razer stuff. So oh, I, went, nice. I went back there. Um, we got accepted by Nvidia as well. So I changed everything. I took out the shit that nobody looked at because what else the point, you know? Now that we sort of know that uh, people are, I guess, more interested in looking at like top-notch gaming hardware, you know, uh -huh. rather than any everyday garbage that they can look at anywhere else. Um, I basically changed all that shit, and it's all like Nvidia shit and Razer shit stuff. So we'll that see. helps us, right? Yeah, it should be more along the lines of what people are sort of expecting, I guess. Greetings. Uh, I went and made a post on the recruiting forum for ESO and a couple other things. Let's see. I'm gonna actually, I'm in the main city, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just go through fucking city and start PMing people. If we can get one or two people a day, I'm laughing. Nice. Hey. How are you hanging in there? No, oh, I'm doing alright, man. Guards are mad at me. I killed the, I killed the poultry. I try not to die. Trying to sneak. I probably should have rolled a tank, man. Doesn't matter what. I heard Dag was, Dag was saying you could tank with the night blade. Really? You can. Yeah, read about, about it. There's Dag. Thought you went to sleep. I just eat. Eat a fucking dog. Why is all these veterans over here, man? I mean, it's like. I'm talking, there's one, two, three, four, six, eight, there's ten veterans over where I'm at. Right around slaughtering shit, nobody low level. I'm the only low level one here, all these like veteran 16. Because they're going to kill you. Shit, I wish they'd try, I'll turn into a vampire, into a fucking werewolf and eat them all. Yum, yum, yum. Islam, you were saying something earlier that to get the armor bonus, like let's say the medium armor bonus, all you need is five pieces, not seven. Right. What, is, yeah. what does that mean exactly? When I have seven, the two pieces don't give me anything? Or no, no. Uh, the last item is usually... Uh, like lessens the bonus or whatever from it? Uh, hang on. No, it didn't lessen the bonus. If you read the passives, uh, I'm trying to find one. Okay, uh, like, under heavy armor, when a set of five or more pieces are equipped, decreases stamina cost by, and each armor suit has a stat like that. Most of them are one or more pieces. So, like, how do you wear leather? Agility, when armor set of five or more pieces are equipped, increase your weapon damage by six percent. So I mean, to get that, that's the minimum requirement is to wear five pieces. Now, granted, if you wear a whole set, you know you get an extra two percent, whatever, whatever. You know what I mean? Okay, okay, okay. I mean, you can. I mean, it's it's either or. It's really, you know, it's all playstyle preference. I think they uh, dumbed it down a little bit because there used to be more more stuff. You had to have five pieces, and it looks like they don't have as many as they used to. Yeah. 
So, I mean, it's, it's kind of for like a little hybridness if you want, um, you know, more hit points and more armor if you like your cloth wear. It, it seems like it works better for cloth wearers or even mm -hmm. heavy wearers, but leather wearers, it doesn't really seem to help out as much. Unless you're like really uh, magic required, but you wear leather, then, you know, you can grab a couple pieces to help you out with your magicka a little bit. Like magicka region and stuff. Mm hmm. Because your stats, uh, magicka, stamina, and health, so like, is based is your damage i mean Stop, so if you're a dex you if you're a, a stamina guy and you've got all your stuff maxed out stamina your weapon damage will do more damage uh, but if you're a caster your weapon damage will do more damage to your magic uh, depending on how high your magic is so it's like your primary stat either magic okay. or stamina or so, health so if let's say uh, are you a caster what are you playing? Uh, okay <laughs> I have all the classes. Uh, okay, so let's say you're playing your caster, whatever that is. So your main stat would be Magicka. Do yeah. you slap all your skill, all your points into Magicka, or do you like... Yeah, the, the, yeah. yeah the, they changed it, because it used to be a cap. You used to have a soft cap if yeah. you went spent too many points, but they, they, they got rid of that. So now hybrids are kind of obsolete, because you can min-max now, and you can just dump all your points into... But yeah, so if you're like a stamina DPS, you want to dump all your points into stamina. Hmm. I started putting some points in health because I noticed I'm fucking so Yeah, so don't, fuck. so don't save me for health. Some have been saving. But like the end game guys' bills are all like magic. Every single fucking point's in there. Yeah. Like, and then nothing and anything else. That's why I didn't want to mm -hmm. end up being too squishy and not be able to run around with myself. That's why the point is just. Well, if one guy. Had 30, had 30, 15 or whatever. Like, yeah, I mean, this, if you're a cloth wearer, like... you know, if you're a cloth wearer, you might want to. I mean, but you also got to consider, you don't know, you got to make sure you check the date on those builds because yeah. they just came out with this only a couple months ago. So, I mean, there's yeah, not a lot of builds out there that are worth the fuck. 2.6 or 2.1 was the size one, but he has, like he said, you said everything's a magic. Yeah. Well, it's not that, that you need the help, it's that if you get hit really hard, you can't heal yourself quick enough, you know what I mean? That's the only reason. I don't have to worry yeah. about dying, I just can keep healing myself. But the thing is, if somebody fucking whacks you, and you're not fast enough, that's it. Well, see, and, and that would be the case, you know, you might want to be a plate wearer. I mean, I don't know. I don't know how your build would work. I mean, I know My you want some defense being a healer because people are going to be gunning for you. But, I don't know. I mean... Uh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, everybody's like tier 16, and they've got like you know, 200 champion points. Mm. Okay, question number whatever, 17. Um, so you get to level cap 50, I think, right? Yeah. And then you start gaining some other points, and you start to level your veteran level? No veterans for PvP. Champion level, I believe, is not I haven't gotten 50 yet, so I don't know. Veteran's going away. <clears throat> They're not going to have veteran no more. Veteran is a placeholder for the champion point. Oh, that's right. That They said something about that in the uh, stream. But you're not, you're not going to No, lose. champion points are something different. The, no. The, you're talking PvP point? No. The, the devs on that thing that we posted, and I actually I think I stuck in here for everybody to read, or listen to was that they said the veteran points is a placeholder for mm -hmm. the champion points but they said that your veteran your veteran rank that you have right now it's not going to go away it's just going to be transferred over to champion which then you'll be able to buy this really super good gear and it's not going to be it's not going to be any more expensive than what it what stuff is now it's not going to like take 500 champion points to to get one piece it'll be like normal and there's other bit other benefits for having it too yeah, in that ESO Live or whatever, they, you know, I remember the guy was talking about that, that they're just a placeholder for the system they really want to put in place. Because they're originally going to get rid of those, they're going to scrap the whole thing. And then they said that they had a fucking lynching going on on the forums. In our terms. 
It's that people didn't want to get rid of it. They did so much work to get it. Oh, I bet, shit. But see, that's what I understand is if the veteran and the champion points are for PvP, why does why does it why does it affect dungeons? There's got to be more to it than that. Yeah. I don't know. I think PvE also get, gives you those points. I don't know. I haven't made level fifty yet. I don't know. And oh, hurry up, man. What the and fuck? and my level forty nine. I'm I'm not getting any veteran points. I'm getting uh, PVP rank and regular XP. You've returned. Then delay no. And I'm PVP rank five on seven hundred. <laughs> Just a five out of seven hundred. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's what it is. I was just looking at my. But I'm not on that guy, so I'm just looked at mine. Okay. But uh, rank, yeah, rank points. Rank points are participating activities for your alliance. And Kyradil, then you can go to. Well, chances are that before we all get into 50, they'll change that system and. At least we'll be able to fucking read up on what's what when they introduced the new one, whatever that's Being called. trapped in the tree was a fate worse than. Oh my god, I want to tongue punch your fart box. Oh <laughs> They're showing a picture of Flo, you know, the progressive girl, Flo. No idea. This guy. You don't know who Flo is? Uh, should I? It's the progressive insurance. got government insurance. insurance. Anyway, she, she is I don't cute. think they have car insurance in Canada. <laughs> we ride on polar bears. <laughs> no, that's Russia. Oh, that's not shit. No, we don't really. It's yeah, it's, it's government where I am. It's kind of fucked up. They made part of the country, uh, some of the provinces, well, the equivalent of your states, some of them opened it up to private companies, so you can buy pri like car insurance from like private insurance company, but on the west coast it's still all government owned. Anyway, sorry, go ahead. He just, there's a picture, which is kind of cute, and the guy wrote, I would tongue punch her in her fart box. I just tried to make a little joke, I didn't have to get all that complicated. A crypter had to open his mouth. We well, gotta get into Canadian in car insurance policies. That Edwig. Is there a way to respec without yep. buying stuff from cash shop? Yeah. Yep. Beautiful. What uh, what does that entail? It's it is a hundred gold per point that you respec. Gold per point. Huh. And you can do your stats too. And it's, I think it's like 50 or 75 per point on your stats. Okay, okay. But make sure there's two options. It'll say uh, respect your morph abilities. And then you got one that says respect your, your, your skill abilities. You have to do the morph ones first because if not, you don't get, they stay morphed. You know how you upgrade your, your taxes? Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. That for me at, <clears throat> at level twenty, it cost me eight hundred gold for to redo my morphs, and then it was like fifteen fifteen hundred gold to do my the rest of them, and then I think it was like eight hundred gold for my stats, my attribute stats. 
And you have to go to Way uh, Waycrest, which is the area just north of uh, Daggerfall or Glum, whatever it is, Grim, You're Grim Globbing. I've already respect four times. What the fuck? You just what? What level are you? Twenty-three. You respect every ten levels? He, Why? He he's indecisive. Give him a break. Well, because. <laughs> I wanted to be a tank, so I went down one line, but it didn't have a certain abilities that I needed. So I respect. Remember, I told you how I kept on respecting, and then finally, me, uh, I made that one where I can actually tank and stay alive. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now that's where I'm at. Okay, so you're happy now, more or less. For now, yeah. For now. Well, that must have cost you a lot of money then. Well. The first probably five cost me store money because I didn't know about the other respect. Who are you? Yes. Hey, Slum, when you break weapons down, can you do it from your bank or does it have to be? In your inventory. I think you can do it for me, mate. It seems like you can. Nope, it's gotta be in your inventory. Motherfucker. I put one point in health, and now every time I look at my character shit, it bugs the shit out of me. I need to take it out. Does it cost money to uh, craft slum? Uh, when you're not selling the gear you find for money, yeah. Because that's how you get broke, because you're breaking all your shit down. No, no, I mean, does it cost money to do the crafting itself, like to use them for oh, crafting? No, no. Okay. I'm sorry. They forced this me to do it. Oh, I have no choice. Oh. I owe you one. And is there a certain level you gotta be to craft? Uh, nope, but the only restriction is you don't have enough um, points to spend in crafting. Okay. So, yeah, I mean, you gotta be high enough level to spend points in your crafting. Okay. That's why we do it, though, with that. I mean, she's just specced in two handed sword. That's it. The rest is all crafting. Oh, yeah. I should take the points from crafting out. Well, the thing is, is you level your skills, and then you know some of them become obsolete. So yeah, respecting is pretty important, really, because you'll get you know like a basic attack from like your basic class or even your weapon and you know once you get closer to 50 in your weapon you're like well I don't ever use this first two items uh, so you can unspec them and just spec at the end of the line whatever you're using
There's a lot of people when we're in, Hold on. in these mid level areas. It's because you can't respect your class, or race, or your class. So you want to re level your characters. Um, is there a way for me to do, like, uh, to find out who's in the zone that I'm in? I don't know. I don't know if there's a who feature. I think there's a help feature, and maybe we'll figure it out. Hey there, you the one? <laughs> then let's get the oblivion. All right, you lovers, time to cast off. Well, 
we're here all. You bet your arse there is. Queen Morea's messenger said she had heard rumors, and I guess they were true. Or something. Nice. This reminds me of zombies. Fords. All the ports. You can't smell their soggy rot. Nah. As if this. How do you think I make a living? This is taking forever. Okay, let's see if we can teleport back. So, where was I questing? This is two quests. The rest are somewhere else. So, let's try with this. This way. Sense. 
or essence room. Finger wounds?
perfect time to join the PvE focused guild. Dag still there. Basil. Crypto. I'm Molly Sadan. <laughs> Bueller. <laughs> Damn. There's so many like little solo instances and shit in here. It's freaking awesome. Yep. Five minutes so far. I think we'll run up to an hour and I'm gonna take a little break, make some fresh coffee, have something to eat, and then I'll come back for another hour or two. Maybe two. Maybe four. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. I'm eager to get to level cap. That's for sure. So, what do we do here? I did this, so let's see. I'm gonna go to the city for this one. That's all the way up there. So, let's go to the city. Do this. Then we'll go west. Finish that other quest. Quest chain. And I think this whole area will be done. Then I'm gonna go. How much gold do we have? Okay, we have it. Then I'm gonna go and finish that one little quest I have left over. What other map we looked at. And after that, we'll continue to where I was. In that really cool looking area. Looks like. Uh, not sure what's more surprising, I don't know. that we made it to Shornhelm or that you did. Well, did you find Marion's neck? Shaw's bones, you did it! Thank you.
Greetings. So we click here, Enchanter, and Craft, oh this is Crafting, okay. can deconstruct items from your bank. No, oh, Basil's not here. Yeah, yeah, I think I'm sure the right one. Tell you, I need copper to make barbaric gear. Okay, I just anytime I see some kind of a metal node, I just gather it, and if I find some, I always keep it. Send over to you. Now, one thing you've been sending me, I don't need are the stuff that says like to craft Nord style or to craft whatever style. Those you can buy for nothing at the vendor, so. Okay. And I got a ship load of stockpile most of them. Okay, so the one point in health I'll take out, put it in stamina, that's fine. Now, if I were to take out all my craft points out... Undaunted, I kinda want it to go in there, but it's not even worth it. Probably not. Oh, increases your max health, stamina, and magic ability. I need mean, to mind that you are good. Okay, that's something I would want. Oh, both of these passives. All these maxed out. I want passives. So maybe that werewolf, soul magic. Yeah, this would be kind of cool. Soul, soul, summon, soul lock. But that doesn't take much. Mm. The world ones are pretty cool. Other than that, nothing really before there. Okay, we'll see. Maybe I'll just take the one point in health out, put it in stem, and leave the rest. He's still not back. I don't guess you've seen my. Some. Despite what I think that's.
So I'll do the side quest first, I just picked it. So we're going to spy this. Yeah, when you look at the copper, it'll say to craft barbaric style. Okay. I've only got one, and that's the first one I've ever found. <laughs> Actually, I haven't even looked at the crafting vendor if they sell that stuff. How do that? that they have some kind of a graphics for what they use for things up and it's like just like a display of this game. Don't eat me! Wait, you're not a spider. I am saved! Oh, thank you! Okay, we're gonna return to the camp, hand this in, and hopefully move on to the one that we're supposed to be going. Or move on to the one that I came here to do. Can't buy it at the I vendor. So. All in one piece. I am never drinking another. Barbaric uh, copper. So you can buy all the other ones, but not that one. Yeah. Well, you know. Mind you, it, because I played Rift for such a long time, it kind of reminds me a bit too much of Rift, the, the core mechanic. And that's essentially really what they are, they work exactly like Rift and Rift. Which were great. Yeah, no complaints there. And the whole the mechanic of random spots spawning events. Looks better. 
I don't like the idea in rifts when you, you would walk really close up to one and over at that point everything changes. It's kind of cheesy I don't know. Drops and veterans level one through five. Copper does. Or if you find barbaric gear, you bring it down. Okay. Well, oh, and you might be able to get it. Get any of that stuff. You'll be the first one to us. Looks pretty cool. It's got a bunch of skulls and shit on the belt. Buckle's got a skull, and the helmet's got a skull. And, and as we all know, skulls are good for you. And skulls are good, and it's got like bones coming off the shoulder pads. It's pretty cool. Okay. Got like ant. <laughs> the mask is a, a skull face with like a hood and like, like demon antlers or really? deer antlers oh. or something. Yeah. Bad. Punishment that person will not receive my guild recruiting spam. Veteran dungeons or the PvP zones. There's solo content out there. PvE content out there. Or in the PvP zone. Nice, so even. Yeah, okay. So the entire zone 4 end cap is PvP and it contains all the usual stuff like cities and. Dungeons and stuff. Well, that's just part of it. There's also veteran dungeons that are just, I don't know where they're at, but. Um, and then, of course, I think some of the newer content's got better. Stuff.
Yeah, so it's their mains. Oh, fuck. Really? You have to go all the way around? Oh shit, we're kicking in some PvP. What? Oh, uh, we own most of the continent. Yes. Uh, it seems like one of our scrolls are missing, but we've got someone else's scrolls. Well, good job, Slum, good job. <laughs> I, <didn't do> <laughs> I just come here to see if I can farm some, sh some stuff. Back to the dungeon. That was sick. Just to make sure I got this. There. Hopefully, hunt in both of those places, uh, and that's it for that. Why will you not listen? Beef with it, beast. What's I stupid horse? You mean, ha. Huh. Fadil, what are you doing? Uh, wait, no. Come back here, you stupid beast. Funcom apparently is making a new Conan game.
Funcom. Oh, yeah, what'd they do? Well, they did the Age of Conan and uh, they did uh, okay. the Secret World and something else that I forgot. But um, I noticed that in that whole press release, it didn't say anywhere about it being an MMO. So it might be just a little RPG game. Okay, I'll just do this and then I'll go on a break. I suppose I could use a break. Oh, and I quit because I didn't know uh, which way. But just the travel point is not. It's not a location for the quest. That's the way I can go to get to the quest. This. Your command of the crafts is impressive, but not yet in total. told that uh, once you open a book and then come back there is still a chance that the same ah excellent give I you can't be yeah. by now granted Varen was in the cave he was captured oh, many okay. travel to if I can in well if you politician don't sound so smart Clivia on the upper floor as well. Hello. Okay, so one worked though. It's always something. So this one and these two maps are done. Let's go to this one. No quests here. That's done. And this one. This is the one we have here. 
so I'm going to teleport here and I'll Google this. Um, I'm gonna teleport there so I can finish that uh, quest. But first, I'm gonna grab some fresh coffee, I'm gonna grab some food, and I'm gonna Google that.